Hi, my name is Catherine Went with Syscon and thanks for taking a moment of your time. Today I wanted to share with you kind of an interesting scam that we ran across. Uh, it's related to text messages. So, um, you know, everyone's become more and more diligent with their email and read it carefully. Don't click on the links and uh, we're, we get spammed by these things and we've got spam filters and everything else. Well, we're seeing a huge growth in the amount of text message scams that are out there. We've had a couple articles and uh, I even shared a specific story that Larry uh, encountered with Verizon on that. So you can check that out in our newsletter. Anyway, this one this time was Mike. So what's happening is, can you imagine if they emailed a lot of people to collect a lot of cell phone numbers, they could blast to all those cell phones, just like they're blasting to your email. And there are a lot less filters and things in the way. And frankly, people kind of glance quickly at their text messages. They're not as careful. They're not as diligent about that. And you can't help but reading the message, whether you've opened it or not. So this is a very great way for them to get in front of you. And it is a growing industry. So here's what happened. So Mike got an email that said it was from me. So it said Catherine went on it. But if you looked carefully, it was a Gmail address and certainly not mine. But that's what it looked like the friendly name. The friendly name was me. And it said that all he had to do was please send his cell phone number because I had an important task for him to work on and to watch for my text message. Wow, you get a couple hundred people to do that, you'd have a nice list to do some text message blasts on there and run some scams and that's exactly what they're doing. So when you see a friendly name on a text message, take an extra moment and uh, um, take an extra moment and see where it's from. If you get an email asking for cell phone numbers, look carefully to see who actually sent that email to you and see if that's really what's happening. And if none of it looks good, delete or feel free to check with the text and they'll be happy to take a look. Thanks for your time. Stay safe and have a great rest of your week.